fire engine That's the sound, the sound of his sirens Finley the fire engine Here comes Finley, it's time to play Ring, 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 somebody's calling Clang, 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 there goes the bell Zoom, 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 rev up your engines Here comes Finley and all his friends Finley the fire engine Hear the sound, the sound of the sirens Finley the fire engine Here comes Finley, it's time to play Ring, 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 let's play with Finley Clang, 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 hear the bell ring Zoom, 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 rev up your engines Here comes Finley and all his friends Finley the fire engine That's the sound, the sound of his sirens Finley the fire engine Here comes Finley, it's time to play Scooty, did you get to school on time? Certainly did, Gorby. Right on schedule. Ice cream, ice cream, we all scream for ice cream. Morning, Jessie. Oh, hi, Isabel. I'm off to the fix-it shop. Isabel, but there is no time for snacks when you have this much post to deliver. Sounds as if you've got a super busy day. See you back at the junkyard. Bye. Good morning, fire station number five. Everybody start your engines. It's a beautiful day. Why does morning have to start so early? Good <laughs> morning <laughs> <laughs> to you too, Scout. <laughs> oh, I'm afraid this old truck isn't what it used to be. That's a lot of exhaust fumes. You're still every bit the heroic fire truck you were the day that you won that trophy. Wow. That's a big trophy. What does a truck have to do to get a big trophy like that? Tell him, Captain Parker. Tell him the story. Yes, tell me the trophy story. Tell me what happened. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. It was a five alarm fire for starters. Five alarms! My head's still buzzing from that one. The Friendlyville Forest was on fire. <clears throat> uh, there was a tree on fire. All right, but it was a great big oak tree at the top of Mount Friendlyville. Everyone was afraid the fire would spread through the town. No ordinary fire engine could have made it in time. Everything that could have gone wrong went wrong. There had been 120 mile an hour winds the night before. Trees fell across the road to Mount Friendlyville, blocking the way to the fire. weighed as much as 50 fire engines, but they were no match for Captain Parker. As fast as you can say, Matt friendly builder Captain was on his way. Up the steepest, roughest mountain you've ever seen. Ian, record-breaking time. Then he whipped out his fire hose and sprayed clear across Mount Friendlyville. <laughs> this story is getting bigger by the minute. That hero part right next to you. Put out the fire in record time. Well, <laughs> I'm off for my morning wash. Wow, Captain Parker. I want to be a hero like you one day. Well, don't believe everything you hear, Finley. Besides, you're already a hero. No, I'm just a plain old fire truck. You have a hero's heart. There rides a car 
Car Wash's dream. He's a hero. What I want to know is how a truck like me becomes a hero like Captain Parker. Let's get slutty. <laughs> Scrubbing all around. Let's get slutty. Heroes are born that way. It's either in your nuts and bolts or it isn't. Being a hero is about setting goals and sticking to them. Remember, Suds? A little extra around the hubcaps. Heroes wear capes and they can leap over tall buildings. Being a hero is dangerous. Well, I can fill up a southbound lorry and get them back on the road in 60 seconds flat. Now that's heroic if I do say so myself. Yes, a regular Wonder Woman. Oh, shush! My Uncle Jack, he's the biggest hero ever. He's stronger and tougher than anyone. Don't be so sure about that, Dex. Hero Man can spin the whole earth on his little finger. I don't know how you become a hero, but if I did, I'd help you. Me too, me too. I'll bring the refreshments. Finley's going to need a lot more than ice cream, Isabel. We're talking about superheroes here. I know, we can start a hero school right here in Friendlyville. They'll be leaping tall buildings in a single bound, rescuing fair damsels from fire-breathing dragons. Oh, and let's not forget introduction to flying. I don't know, Isabel. I think I'd rather be a hero who keeps his wheels on the ground. Do my tyres look dirty? Hmm, Captain Parker's strong and fast and brave. So if I can make myself strong and fast then... And... Come on, Gorby and Isabel. If I'm going to be a hero, I can't waste another minute. I'm going to be a hero, big and strong and brave. When someone's in danger, I'll always save the day. I'll be a hero, hero. Coming to your aid, everybody a hero, hero Watch me save the day, oh yes I will Who am I falling? I just don't have the right nuts and bolts to be a hero <laughs> What do we do? Hang on there, Scout. Philly's on his way. <laughs> oh no, should we call Captain Parker? Scout needs help now, Gorby. This ought to just about. <laughs> Scouts, you're going to be okay. Yes, yes you got you him. You got him. <laughs> <laughs> you got it. You got it. <laughs> I haven't seen you for hours, young Finley. How have you been? Not so terrific. It only took one hard day of drills and exercises for me to realise that I'll be old before I'm a superhero. But Finley, you can't work at being a hero. It's something that's just inside you. Inside you, maybe, but not inside me. Don't try and get up there, Scouts. You've done enough climbing for one day. Scout got himself stuck up at the very top of that giant tree down at the park. <coughs> How did you get him down? It wasn't easy. My ladder wouldn't reach and neither would my hose. I ended up having to tie the ladder to the hose to reach Scout. Quick thinking. I'm proud of you. There you are. You are a hero. But all I did was help my dog out of the tree. I didn't get any medals or anything. Being a hero isn't about trophies or having the fastest engine or the strongest ladder. It's about caring for your friends, 
and trying your best to help them. And that's what you did today. Really? That makes me a hero? Absolutely. <laughs> and Scalp thinks so too. Ooh, is it time to get up already? No, Mr. Bell, it's time for bed. A hero needs his rest. Hey, hey, Billy. The fire engine's rolling into town. Hey, hey, Billy. You're the fire engine of the year. Let's go, Billy. We light up whenever you're around. 